Yo, what's up, YouTube? Welcome to the Coffee Pod. My name is Chishi Zed. Drink the coffee, it'll make you feel better. She cheated on me, had a baby, and then I proposed. Let's get it. I was engaged um, three years ago with a girl. Hmm. Uh, three years ago, I was engaged with a Cameroon girl, and she cheated on me because I didn't have like this good situation because I was still a student and I was still, you know, building myself up. And um, at the end of the story, like she was frustrated uh, because like I didn't like had a good situation. So she decided to cheat. I forgave her. Then later she like got pregnant of one guy and I like, still forgave her. And then later I was like, okay, well, maybe. Yo, it sounds like she cheated twice. Sounds like she cheated twice. I'm in shock. My man up there is in shock. We're all in shock, right? This man is full of forgiveness. <laughs> Too much for me, man. It's because like, I didn't propose to her. That's why she's misbehaving. And I said, okay, let me propose. And the thing is like, you know, it was <laughs> foolishness. Yeah, it was because the thing is like, my, the way my mom raised me up, she was like, bingo. The way my mom raised me up, Single mothers raise simps, and so do beta men, unfortunately. But are we surprised that he said the way his mom raised him put him in the situation? I don't think so. Mercy. Let's keep watching. Um, you know, uh, sometimes in life you have to support certain situations, and maybe you know with maturity we're gonna go step further, but. <laughs> All right, as always, man, the internet reacted. Let's see what people thought of this man who was very nice, forgiving, too good to a woman who did not deserve it. First comment comes from a woman and it says, no, bless him, he's one of the rare good men. And this woman is just abusing him. Why is it like this? <laughs> oh my gosh, listen. She's, she's saying, why is it like this? Because she says, why is it like this? Why does she get the good man? Ma'am, you choose who you date. You would not have dated this man, most likely. And if he was with you, you would have treated him like shit too. This is where men are confused, right? This comment has 46 likes and they read this and they think, you know what? There's still good women out here who appreciate a nice guy, not good guy. Not a man who respects others who have earned his respect. Not a man who knows how to stand up for himself, but treat his woman well. No, there are guys who will read this and say, being nice is okay. Being nice is not okay with women. Not today, brother. Not today. And you better accept it. You better learn it. You better believe it. And women in these type of situations will always say, this is the type of guy they want. They are lying. Next comment from another man says, a man said she was misbehaving with laughing emojis. Yeah, that was hilarious. Nah, that's wild. Next comment. This guy says, this is what modern man is. So sad. Yes, modern man today is a simp, nice guy who's waiting for his queen so that he can worship her and put her on a pedestal. This gentleman says, this is the Oxford Dictionary description of a simp. <laughs> With the face palm, I agree, bro. Next comment says, what's his at so I can show him what real women look like? Oh, poor baby. <laughs> yeah. Another woman who's claiming that this is the type of man that she wants and she, she would treat him right. Nah, man. It's not how it works. Do not be deceived, gentlemen. Next, we have a woman here who says he needs to listen to Future's music. <laughs> yes, sir. Drink the coffee. It'll make you feel better. That's some good advice. Listen, I'm the first to tell you there's some good things you can learn from Future. There's some good things you can learn from Pookie and Ray Ray, right? You can learn some things about game. And finally, the last comment says why fathers are needed. Yeah, not only for women, but also for men. Listen, guys, as always, curious to know what you thought of the video. Leave your comments down below. I appreciate you for checking out yet another episode of The Coffee Pod. Till next time, I'm out. Peace.